First we'll access the Nessus downloads page. We'll select our version and platform. We'll hit the download button. License screen will pop up. We can agree to that. The download will now start. We'll wait for this to complete. Okay, so it has now completed. We'll open up terminal and we will change directories to our downloads folder. We'll list contents and we'll grip and essentially search for our Nessus download. Okay, we've now got our file name. We'll now use DPKG to install the software. Okay, so this can now start running. Enter our pseudo password. Okay, so this is now gonna read the database, it's gonna install the software. And once it's complete, it should give us a bit of information on how to start. Okay, so we can start the Nessus scanner and we can also navigate and configure our scanner. So we'll start by systemctl start Nessus service. Okay, this has now started the service. We'll now navigate to our machine's host name and onto the port 8834, which is the default port that Nessus runs on. We'll get a warning here for a local certificate. We can accept the risk here. Okay, it's now going to initialize. Okay, now welcome to Nessus. We can register offline, but we don't need to. We'll continue there. Uh, there's different options to install Nessus. We're going to go for Essentials and Continue. Here, we need to obtain the activation code. So we're going to enter our details. This will then give us an activation code. We'll continue. We now need to create a user account. I've already had a previous account installed. So I'm going to continue using the same credentials as I had in the previous install. Submit that. Okay, so the setup is now complete. It's going to start downloading plugins. This will take five minutes or so. Uh, once this completes, we'll now get a uh, notification saying that Nessus is still building in the background. Uh, we're not going to be able to create a new scan at this point, but what we can do is take a look at the events. Okay, so we can see that it's starting to build itself out. Uh -huh, we're going to be able to see the version here and go back to scans. Yep, not going to be able to do anything yet. We'll give this a minute to complete. Okay, it's now completed. Get a little pop-up here for a host discovery. We can close that off. Plugins are done compiling. We can check the settings. We can see the version here. We can also see the plugin set and the plugin updated time. Okay, so we've got a notification there. Software update complete. Okay, we'll go back to scans. We can now create a new scan and we're able to access the generic scans. We're not going to be able to use the ones with upgrade because that is for the premium service, but we can now be ready to use uh, Nessus Essentials.